In today's video, we are going to learn how to ask questions in French. When you write, add a question mark at the end of the sentence, like in English. When you speak, your voice must rise at the end of the sentence. Compare, tu aimes le chocolat, you like chocolate, this is a statement, and tu aimes le chocolat, do you like chocolate, this is a question. In French and in English, you have two types of questions, closed questions and open questions. Closed question can only be answered by oui, yes, or non, no, or similar answers. For example, tu t'appelles Marc? Non, je m'appelle François. Is your name Marc? No, my name is François. Open questions relate to specific elements in the sentence and they use interrogative words. For instance, Comment t'appelles-tu? Je m'appelle François. What is your name? My name is François. There are three ways of asking questions in French. They depend on the context. With the expression est-ce que? With the inversion of the verb and the subject. And with the voice rising at the end of the question. Firstly, the expression est-ce que? corresponds to a fairly neutral or slightly informal register. The order is interrogative word, if any, plus est-ce que, or Q apostrophe before a vowel, plus subject, plus verb. For instance, est-ce que tu manges? Are you eating? Qu'est-ce que tu manges? What are you eating? Secondly, the inversion is used in relatively formal context. The order is Interrogative word, if any, plus verb, plus subject, with a hyphen between the verb and the subject. For example, Manges-tu? Are you eating? Que manges-tu? What are you eating? In the third person singular, when the verb ends with an E or an A, add ti between hyphens, between the verb and the subject. The T has no meaning, it is only used to make the pronunciation easier. For example, Mange-t-il? Is he eating? A-t-elle un chat? Does she have a cat? In the first person singular of the present indicative, the inversion does not always work. It is better to use the expression est-ce However, there are a few constructions that are correct. For instance, Ai-je? Do I have? Suis-je? Am I? Or, verge, am I going? When the subject is not a personal pronoun, but a proper noun or a noun phrase, the order subject verb is kept, but a personal pronoun, il, elle singular or il, elle plural, is added. For example, les enfants mangent-ils? Are the children eating? When the sentence starts with an interrogative adverb, we have the choice. For instance, Comment s'appelle ton frère? Or, Comment ton frère s'appelle-t-il? What is your brother's name? Finally, the rising voice is used only in informal context. You keep the same order as in a statement and you add a question mark. Your voice rises at the end of the sentence. For instance, Tu manges? Are you eating? When you use an interrogative word, you place it after the verb and que becomes quoi. For instance, tu manges quand? When do you eat? Tu manges quoi? What are you eating? So, to summarize, in French, you add a question mark at the end of a question and generally you raise your voice when speaking. There are two types of questions, closed questions, the answer is yes or no, and open questions, which use an interrogative word. And in French, there are three ways of asking questions. The least formal one is the rising voice. Then we have the question with est-ce que? And finally, the most formal way of asking question is the inversion of the subject and the verb. Au revoir. Created using Powtoon.